SMT Nation, welcome back to the channel. It's good to have you guys here for this video. We're talking about some important things coming out of T-Mobile and their retail presence, national retail presence, I should say. They're going into Walmarts and they're going to be doing this and it's been a while for them. They're going postpaid, they're going prepaid. All right, so this is interesting. I got all the details for you. If it is your first time here, definitely take the opportunity to go ahead and subscribe to the channel and then turn on the bell notification so you never miss an upload. Let me give you the details and then I'll do my SMT takeaways. All right, so T-Mobile is going in. They're going into Walmart, making the conversion to the Magenta branded postpaid. Obviously, there used to be Sprint in these places, but they're also going to be introducing Metro by T-Mobile into the 2300 estimated stores in October. T-Mobile's prepaid Metro by T-Mobile brand will be available at select Walmart locations starting October 18th. The stores are going to carry the smartphones, including the 5G devices. They're going to bring in three unlimited plan options. They'll have the SIM cards for the devices, and then customers can purchase in-store and activate online. Beginning November, consumers can shop at Walmart locations for T-Mobile branded postpaid devices and plans as well, including Magenta Max, as well as the Magenta Plan as well as the essentials plan. I think all those can happen there. Very nice. Activate in store as well. In the announcement, T-Mobile indicated it's looking to reach customers in more locations for 5G plans and devices. So the EVP, John Fryer of the uh, T-Mobile Consumer Group, spoke about the growth of the company, them wanting to get into all parts of the country, more retail space, more options, more plans, extend and reach more customers, give them more op options for shopping, picking up devices and services. T-Mobile is converting uh, Sprint's Walmart presence to now be sold as the Magenta brand. Postpaid service at Walmart has been marketed with the Sprint powered by T-Mobile branding and already available in 2,100 stores. The Best Buy integration is ongoing. T-Mobile from Sprint, that adds presence as well. This move completes the retail parity with Verizon and AT&T. This has to be viewed as huge for T-Mobile, in my opinion. They're really the only missing MNO from these wireless retail locations, which total to several thousands. They never were really in the game, so now they are. And what this means for the Metro uh, brand and Metro customers, uh, for the carriers prepaid Metro by T-Mobile brand, it's a big move. Metro hasn't been sold in national retail for a long time. It's been years. So this puts them back in the game. So... Uh, for many years, they haven't really had that presence at Walmart or any national retail for that matter. And now you're talking about growth potential. They already have 21 million customers. It puts them right up against like TrackPhone. And now with TrackPhone, you know, going in an acquisition of Verizon, potentially, this makes things pretty interesting as at and has Cricket, Dish with Boost Mobile. So I don't think this was expected a year or two ago. This is a major shift in prepaid philosophy for T-Mobile and Metro. And I think this meets a lot of things, checks a lot of boxes for T-Mobile. America, uh, rural America, I think it's a check mark. Walmarts are all over the place. Postpaid, they get that presence. And then prepaid, they get that presence. I think it's a big deal. What say you? Sound off in the comments section below. You all are the voice of the people of the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard. Love to hear your thoughts and opinions. Like this video, comment down below, share this video, and then subscribe for more SMT content. Thanks for watching, and we will see you all in the next video. Peace.